hello guys welcome to my channel today we are going to see how to fix the issue with modern warfare 3 pocket blast as well as latency variation let's fix it guys the first solution consists of two step the first step is to update windows guys to do this you just need to right click on the start icon and select settings on left side select windows update select check for updates if you have any available update listed over here then you just need to update it guys and make your operating system up to date and after doing this close it over here the second step you need to make sure you turn off any third party antiviruses that you have installed in your system for example Norton, Avast or AVG and you need to uninstall Norton game optimizer this is the major cause for modern warfare 3 pocket blast you need to make sure to uninstall Norton game optimizer and then launch the game and check if the problem solved or not if not let's move on to the second solution guys the second solution is to use the custom DNS to do this you just need to go to search menu and type view network connection click on open it right click on the internet you are using it in my case I am using Ethernet select properties select internet protocol version 4 and select properties select here use the following DNS server addresses in preferred DNS server you just need to type 1111 in alternative DNS server you just need to type 1001 and select OK this is a cloud fair dns guys this is safe to use select close and close it up here now you just need to go ahead and restart your pc after restarting your pc launch the game and check if the problem solved or not if not let's move on to the third solution guys the third solution you need to launch the game guys after launching the game select the gear icon over here and select graphics and after selecting the graphics click on quality tab and you just need to set vram scale target to 70 after setting 70 you just need to scroll down and weather grid volumes you just need to select either low or turn it off and after doing this next for nvidia users right in the graphics settings you need to find the option DLSS frame generation you just need to turn it off and NVIDIA low reflex latency you just need to turn it off after doing this changes you just need to select apply settings after selecting apply settings next you need to select apply for save changes and go back and relaunch the game and check if the problem solved or not I hope one of these solution fixed your problem guys if the video helped you don't forget to leave a like guys you can also subscribe me and support me guys thank you